Hey everyone, how's it going? Age Graceful here. This month, the ladies from the Beauty Over 40 Makeup Collab Group are doing a movie spoof from The Lady Sings the Blues. This month will be The Ladies That Paint the Blues. Let's take a peek at these inspiration looks. We're going to begin by cleaning up my eyebrows. I'm using a Warm Honey Shade Concealer from LA Pro Girl. This is a full coverage concealer. I'm just going to pull this concealer down and use it as my eyeshadow base as well. For today's look, I've selected the Icy Blue Raspberry Palette from Glam Light. These are the shades. This is a 12-pan palette composed of mattes and glitters. This palette does not have shade names, so I'm going to use an arrow every time I pick up a new shade. Follow along, please. The first shade that I'll apply today is like a cornflower blue. Cornflower blue. Blue is something that they used on Corningware products back in the day. The white dishes with the blue flowers. I'm sure you guys remember those. The second shade is a deep royal blue shade. These first two shades are both matte. This is the first of the glitter shades that I'll apply on my inner corner. It's a silvery blue shade that is very similar to the cornflower blue shade. This next glitter shade is like a purple blue. If you could evenly mix purple and blue, this is what you would get in my estimation. It's very pretty. I'll put this in the center of my lid. The next shade is a royal blue glitter, and I'll put this on my outer third. Next, I'll use my brush that I used to apply the cornflower blue shade, and I'll smooth out the rough edges of all the glitter shades. Now I will prepare my complexion. Today I'll be using the No Problem Primer Water. The No Problem Primer Water prepares the skin by plumping it and filling the pores so that your application of either powder or liquid foundation goes on much smoother. On my complexion, I'll be using the Fenty Beauty Pro Filter Powder Foundation in shade number 400. Today, my bronzer and blush is from the Beauty Bakery.
On my waterline, I'll be using a pencil by Jordana. The shade is called Sapphire. How many of you have seen the movie, The Lady Sings the Blues? It's a loose biographical film about the life of singer Billie Holiday. The major stars were Diana Ross and Billy D. Williams, as well as Scatman Carruthers and Richard Pryor. I looked at the movie as more of a love story than a biography. Diana Ross did win an Academy Award for her portrayal as Billie Holiday in this film. My complexion is all completed and I'll move on to my eyelashes. I'll be using the Kiss Liner Glue as my adhesive today. Today I'll be wearing lashes from Timu. This is the fox eye style. I'm just wrapping up applying my Charlotte Tilbury Brown Lip Pencil. And I will be using This Is Milky Gloss by NYX. This shade is called Milk the Cocoa. This lip gloss is super hydrating and it is infused with vegan milk. You can apply one or two swipes or you can build up your color. It's up to you. This is a beautiful shade for deeper skin tones. I absolutely love a neutral lip, especially when my eye is heavy full of shade. Thank you so very much for selecting my channel to watch today. After you finish watching my video, please go over to the other ladies' channels and watch their videos. I'll be leaving their channel links in my description box here. You all take care. See you in the next video. Bye.